The project involved on-site engagement with the Ovahimba people and led to the collaborative creation of a digital, multilingual and multimedia cultural heritage collection. The distinct result is a web application that was initiated by the community and categorized into three groups, human beings, livestock and forest. This application features audio narratives in the Oshiherero language. The Ovahimba community curated a collection of photos, audio recordings and videos that were gathered by both researchers and communities over the course of a decade of collaborative projects. This project emerged as a result of the work of a master's student. For this specific project, we have conducted about seven focused community-based co-design workshops, some in the most difficult time of COVID in 2021. Starting with mixed videos and photos collected by Mr. Warieke since 2013, and snippets of text from the Wikipedia and newspapers, we projected this to the Ovahimba communities for valid validation. Many digital artifacts have been amassed over the years depicting the intricate Ovahimba culture. Nevertheless, a substantial portion of these artifacts lacks validation from the Ovahimba communities themselves. Consequently, the omission of their insights has led to an imprecise portrayal of their cultural heritage. They made several visits to our communities and they initially asked us about our ideas and opinions. After engagement, they taught us how to record using modern technology. In 2020, the Indigenous Knowledge Research Cluster submitted a grant application for 140 to the Carl Schleitwein Stiftung Foundation. The purpose of the grant was to support a project titled A Co-Created Digitalization of Cultural Heritage with the Ovahimba People, which ultimately led to the development of the web application. Additionally, the project received financial backing from MTC and the National Commission for Research, Science and Technology.